I support Claudia Alvarez to remain as mayor pro tem for the city of Santa Ana. No one, including Alvarez, will deny that she made a regrettable word choice in her analogy describing the business tactics of downtown in pres President Irving Chase. But to call that mistake an anti-Semitic tirade is an equally insulting and over broad claim with insufficient evidence. She made a correlation between two individuals in order to shed light on an injustice she believes her colleagues are failing to see. Uh, and I understand under Robert's Rules of Order there can be a suggestion of a motion from the floor. I would, I would suggest that there be a motion made that Carlos be made Mayor Pro Tem, Claudia get some sensitivity training, and once that is shown that it has worked, <laughs> I'm not trying to be funny, uh, once that has shown that has worked, uh, then we go back to normal status. Banning her in anti-Semitic is truly ridiculous. She displays a passion for all real issues in downtown Santa Ana. I came to United States and I am leaving the United States because I am a Jewish. Uh, our issue here is much more important than whoever is here and talking about. Our, our issue is illegal taxation. And I congratulate Mr. Alvarez, Mrs. Ms. Alvarez, that supported us. And, I, and we have a lot of issues. A lot of issues that are contentious and a lot of issues that at times we have, cannot handle. And yes, we've made mistakes, and I don't think anyone on this dais could say that they have not made a mistake. I don't think anyone in this room could say that. But we, we pick up from those mistakes, we dust stuff, we apologize, and we start working towards unity. And I ask you to please, let all of us take three steps back, cool down, we'll resolve this pivot issue, and we'll resolve whatever damage has been caused by this pivot issue and my comments.